installation on the USB drive that we're running for Linux. It's going to be on Ubuntu. Is going to be burnt to it as an image. Um, today we're using Image USB by Passmark Software, version 1.4. I use this one because it's it doesn't take a whole lot of space on my computer. Also, it's pretty quick, efficient, and just has basic needs that I'm trying to get. Let's see if we're here. You want to get Lubuntu? I chose Lubuntu because it's a pretty um, light operating system. Doesn't take a whole lot of memory or space, and it's user friendly. You should get the 18.04.3 Bionic Beaver LTS That's for 64. Or if you have a 32-bit operating system, or you can do another your Raspberry Pi version if you want to do a Raspberry Pi version. The other versions, the other flavors, sorry, are okay, but they're not going to be supported after a certain date, which is this year actually. And this is more of a long-term flavor. So once you do, you download that, which I've already done. Then you go ahead and put it in a folder. It's very done. Take that. Go to your image USB passmark. Um, you click on which USB you're choosing. If you have something already burnt onto this, you refresh your drives and it will go ahead and make it ready for a new burn and we'll go ahead and click what you want you go ahead and want to 18.4 or 3 desktop md64 save it's right there I already got a USB drive post image verification I don't really check any other boxes and you could do this if you want to you could Create image from USB drive, zero USB drive, reformat USB drive too. And just go ahead and click right. Once you click right, it'll prompt you. It's correct what you're putting onto and what you're using. Okay, so yes. File warning contents drives are replaced. It'll wipe your entire USB drive, so just keep that in mind, whatever you have on there go ahead and take off before you put before you use the image burn software say so yes that's going it's pretty slow so if you're looking for to do some a larger file and try and burn an image onto USB you might want to use different kind of software it also depends on the USB how fast all right it's all done. Image completed. Okay, you're good to go. You can go ahead and exit out of here. All right, and the next step would be to go ahead and oh, I forgot to tell you one thing. You can get any kind of the Passmark software for free. Your products. Go down here. Image USB. Learn more. Download. There's a whole bunch of different other kind of utility programs and other software. Utility software and other programs you can get to for free or if you want to buy for them.